What's up guys, today I'm going to show you how to set up MLA format 2014 in Google Docs. So the first thing you want to do is open up a fresh Google Doc and then change the font, uh, font Times New Roman size 12 and then you want to make the double or spacing set to double. Then to begin you type in your first and last name and sorry that I'm typing kind of slow because I have to hold the microphone with one hand. Don't ask why. Then you press enter once. Type in your professor's name or teacher's name, whatever you want to call it. And then on the next line you do the class. So like English 101. And on the next line you do the day in, or the date in day, month, year format. And this is important, it has to be in this format, and you don't put commas or, and you don't shorten the days like this, absolutely not. Uh, I spelled it wrong. There we go. Then you press enter one more time, and on the next line, you center, and this is where the title of the paper will be. Title of paper. Then go down one more, and back to the left here. And then you press the tab key once to end in, indent. And this is where you begin writing. Now, I'm not going to write an essay, of course, but um, you can just go to the end here, go to Insert uh, Page Break, and this will be the Works Cited page, and it will automatically go down as you type, so it's always on a new page like it should be. So then you center it, type in Works Cited, just like that, no bolding or anything. Then go down one more, go to the left, and this is where you can make your citations or copy and paste it from EasyBib or something making sure they're all Times New Roman and um, follow the hanging indent but that's it for another tutorial so going back up you will also need a header with your last name and page number and to do this you just go to insert header and then actually no you don't do that you go to insert page number top of page and then you go use the left arrow key or maybe the space key and then the left arrow key then this is where you put your last name um, and if it's too high on the page and your printer won't print it or something you can just press enter once and there you go Oh, going back here you always want to make sure it's Times New Roman size 12 or it won't be good. Now that looks good and you'll notice if you go down to here the last name stays the same but the page number changes and that's what you want. And that is how you set up MLA format 2014 in Google Docs.